What's up guys, it's Ava. What's up y'all, it's Zoe. Hey y'all, it's Caitlin. And today we have a sushi buffet. So we're so excited today. We have all so an assortment fun. of sushi. We have some sashimi, we have some sushi, we have some rolls, some yeah. hand rolls. And we got some lemons. Mm -hmm. uh, tuna avocado here, salmon avocado, okay. regular salmon, yellow tail, spicy tuna hand rolls, salmon avocado hand roll, vegetable roll, Katie's favorite. Octopus sashimi, I love octopus sashimi. Mm -hmm. Then we have some salmon sushi, some tuna sushi, some salmon sashimi, mm. some tuna sashimi, some yellow tail sashimi, yellow tail sushi, Octopus sushi and then like buku, buku, wasabi, buku, ginger, ginger sriracha, spicy mayo, soy, soy sauce. sauce. So Damn, like, okay. We got a <laughs> Let's, <let's now>. eat. <laughs> let's get into it. Alright, um, I'm gonna just go for a regular little yeah. salmon. And we have these little plates to eat off of. I'm gonna try a little octopus sushi. Jean. Shoot, I lost some rice in it, honey. Oh, wait. I got this for Daz, my soy sauce. What you putting in there? Wasabi? Wasabi. Oh, yeah. mm. This is y'all. Wasabi and soy sauce is like crucial. I'm gonna take this. I'm gonna grab So good. It's so really fresh. fresh. That's what I love about sake. Yeah. It is like delicious. Shout out to Saki from Shout uptown. Out Saki, from out. <laughs> On Magazine Street, New Orleans. It's so good. But yeah, sushi is like, I would say top five favorite food. Like, I at least yeah. have sushi once a week. Sushi's like a top one. Top one. <laughs> top one. <laughs> top top one. Top number one. one. Top yeah. one is not two. <laughs> top two is not two. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Period. 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 It's so, I would love sushi. Thumbnail. I can eat sushi every day oh, and not get tired of it. So we Okay. Oh. <laughs> We're mixing up our soy sauce. Mix it up. Mix it up. See, I don't put wasabi in my soy sauce. I'm the only one who doesn't do that. No, wasabi you gotta. Actually, All right. I like to put. Well, wait. Okay, um, let's yeah, go. continue. Same so yeah, get a little sriracha. You like sriracha with your sush? With your sush? Anything I like also I cake. put lemon in my soy sauce and wasabi. It kind of is like ponzu, but it hit different with lemon in it, y'all. I'm telling y'all. Ponzu sauce is amazing. I love ponzu. This is like my own little creation of ponzu. I just love sweet, sweet old soy sauce. <laughs> sweet, <laughs> good, sweet, old sweet old classic. Good old soy sauce. I just think yeah. the vegetable roll tastes really good. I think really that was the only one. Yeah, the vegetable rolls. I'm gonna get a tuna. But yeah, I think my favorite rolls would be salmon avocado. I'm gonna go for and then the like vegetable. my favorite sashimi is um oxford sashimi. Mm. I think I'm gonna do my favorite rolls: salmon avocado, sashimi, salmon, and octopus. That's so it's a tie. It's a tie. But yeah, those are my top two favorites. I think I'm gonna go with salmon tuna and yellow tail. And like spicy tuna, it's like anything that could be spicy. So delicious. Yeah, I love a lot of wasabi. And you know what's so funny? I'm gonna do a tuna. A lot of people don't eat raw sushi and I'm like, how? I wonder, I'm gonna dip this tuna in this spicy mayo. I don't really bang with spicy mayo like that. So let's see. Let's see what I think. But a lot of my friends eat cooked sushi, but I never eat cooked sushi. I eat it, but it's not something I, I love. Like sushi. I think I like any kind of sushi. Me too. I don't think I. I can't get with the spicy mayo because it's like creamy, and with yeah. sushi creamy and sushi that don't mix to me. Wait, can I try the spice? Yeah, the spicy it. mayo is also good. If you get like hibachi rice. Oh yeah, yeah, no, I will agree. Yeah. Hibachi rice is some spicy mayo. Oh, hits. Mm -hmm. All right, so right now I have the yellow taro with spicy mayo. I'm gonna try it. Yellow taro sashimi. Looks so fresh. I know it's really good. Is it good? Mm-hmm. Let me try that. 
But I like spicy mayo. I so don't. I, I don't think I like it that much. Like I'd be trying to give it a try, but I don't think I would put it that much. I like it. Let me try some sound. I can't get with it. It's mayo. It's just spicy. I can't get with it. And get with it. Mm. Let me see what this salmon. Ooh, salmon. Salmon sashimi is about. It was super fresh. I already had it. It was. It was good. Mm -hmm. Let me try the tuna. Mm -hmm. I'm going to try this octopus sushi. So good. Sushi noodle rice. So delicious. <laughs> that rice just came apart. I hate that. That's my, like, I hate that when it happens. The rice fell? Mm-hmm. Oh, man. It's so delicious. Octopus is it. so chewy. I love it though. So, make sure I'm gonna have a little. If you don't like the chewy mm -hmm. consistency, then you might not like that. I love the chewy consistency. Y'all, I I know so many people that hate ginger. I think ginger I is it. delicious. I, I love it. ginger. Really? Yeah, I don't like it. I love ginger. And then, fun fact: ginger, you're not really supposed to eat it as like a thing. It's supposed to use to cleanse your palate after so every like, time. So like, after you, you have a roll. Sushi. Or eat whatever you have ginger, and then you go to the next one. Yeah, I'm gonna see what this yellowtail sushi roll. Oh man! Oh, the, is that what you're talking about? The right no, I didn't have that. But yeah, when I try to pick it up, it was, oh, like, it was coming apart. It's all good. Wait, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I love this little. Is this horseradish? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know about no that ain't horse rice, it's radish. Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so good. Horse is like that spicy stuff. That you put on uh, It's so good in spicy. Super good. Mm-mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Who put y'all on to sushi? My mom. <laughs> My mom for sure. We, or well, I, Zoe did it. When my parents first had me, they moved to Japan for a year. Or like, was it two years? What were we doing two years? I think it was either yeah. a year or two when I was like just born. I was born here, but we went to Japan after I was born and we lived there for like a year. So I feel like sushi was always like a big, like part of our food that we ate. Like we always had sushi. Like I remember eating sushi when we was little kids. I yeah, feel like a lot of people that. had didn't have sushi till they was like older. Yeah. And I remember having sushi young young and yeah. having raw sushi. Raw sushi. Like, we used to eat salmon and tuna when we was little kids eating yeah. raw stuff. But we just always loved it. Loved it. And that was probably why having lived in Japan and my parents liking sushi. I feel like you eat what your parents eat. Yeah. So they always mm -hmm. liked all that stuff. So we loved it. I'm banging with the sushi. So, so y'all, today we have a tiny topic. Tiny topic. Tiny topic. And our it time, is. Yeah. <laughs> our tiny topic is stereotypes about girls that boys have. So, like, for example, like, you know how some boys think, like, <coughs> oh, Lord, you <laughs> hear my throat? <laughs> oh, <what? laughs> Just back. But you know how, for example, you know how some boys think that if a girl goes out a lot or she has wears little tight kind of scandalous maybe more that she's a thot. That she's a thot. <laughs> exactly. not a thot that is not always true. Now, mm -hmm. of course, sometimes it no. might be the truth. But girls can true. wear what they want and express themselves how they want mm -hmm. without being called a hoe. Yes, I agree. Period. I agree. I think if a girl goes out a lot, that does not necessarily mean she's whatever or she's the thought. She she's might just like to have fun. My, she, have fun with her friend. Everybody has different personalities. All girls should not have to just stay inside yeah. and never go out just because that's what looks good to a man. You know, like but the yeah. man going out every Saturday. Yeah, he, uh -huh. he always it louder. It's <laughs> like. So, Sit, like, you know, I mean, <laughs> if, if you are a homebody, which I definitely, I think I'm a homebody. I like to be yeah. at home. I don't like to go out that much. Right. But I don't think that makes me any better than the girls who go out every weekend, you know? Yeah. Like, 
do what you want to do. I don't think you should ever do anything just based off, oh, I stay home because oh, that looks look, good. Yeah. Like, no, I stay home because I like to stay home. You know? Mm-hmm. If you Which go out, you go out. I love Netflix. Exactly. <laughs> I love chill environments. Now, girl, when I want to go out, I go out. You know? But I don't ever do it off of what looks good to me. You know? Right. And you never should. It's Wait, what looks good to you. To you, what you want to do. You know? Now, me, I like going out with my friends. I like having a lot of fun. So, being in a relationship where the person didn't want me to go out, never been a thing. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, no. But that's a funny thing because, okay, what if he tells you, oh, you can't go out? Or like... Oh, you're not going out tonight? I think that is like... That's That's insecure and controlling. Yeah. You should not want to be that. Yeah, you should want to be like that. If you want to go out, go ahead, babe, go out. Did if I want to go me? out, yeah, let me go out. Yeah. Exactly. And then it's like the people, the boys who be like, Oh, y'all going to let y'all girl leave the house like this? Um, yeah. Like, <laughs> you're not my dad. Yeah, exactly. Like... Like, why are you pressed about what I wear? And I don't think what a girl wears dictates her, like... And first of all... Makes her be perceived as a You should type feel good that, oh, this girl look good. Yeah. So, people gonna be looking, but who she for? You. you. So, you should feel good, like... It really everybody like my girl, everybody, she, this, she, yeah. that, you know? It shouldn't be like, no, you can't go out. Exactly. Like, what? And if she look good, is she a bad... A baddie? Bitch? A bad, then, a bad bitty. Yeah, bad, bad bitty. bitty. And you can't handle it? But you don't need it. You don't need it. You don't need a bad bitty. Yeah, you can't handle. You need a mild bitty. Yeah. <laughs> a lukewarm bitty. A lukewarm like, bitty. Uh, yeah. But yeah, that that's not for you. But I hate that stereotype because I feel like when it comes to guys, they be tweaking to like go out and do this and they don't really care about, you know what they wear or not anything like that or what other girls are wearing but they be so pressed about that specific girl i think She's the like, main stereotype i have got is the oh i look bougie oh my god that is, people think i'm bougie that is yeah. our main stereotype people call all three of us bougie all the time yeah and really if you get to know us and you be around us and you know our personalities i feel like we have bougie qualities i will not lie <laughs> But for the most part, like I feel like we so cool and we so down to earth. And so all of the boys who think we bougie once they actually hang out with us, they're like, they're y'all, like are y'all so cool because cool. we're crazy. Like and we're crazy, crazy. Yeah. So it's like, like at we're party. Like us. <laughs> 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 we're we're <laughs> But no, um, at a party, this is my main pet peeve. Is like bougie girls who like stand there at the party and kind of just like look around and just like. Judging everybody, I'm not that. T- if I'm going to a party, I'm there to have fun. I'm dancing. I'm like really talking to people, joking around with, with people. And then once they see that, they're like, "Oh yeah, I thought she was gonna be bougie and sit in the corner." Yeah, That's I don't miss a good time. <laughs> I'm bougie and like the kind of food, maybe bougie. <laughs> food bougie, like just bougie on what I eat. No, this oh, she hot hot chills all day. Day. Yeah, yeah, hot chills all day. Yeah, hot chills. Um, Finer things in life. So. <laughs> That's high quality guys. <laughs> no. High quality guess. But I feel like like at parties I'm definitely not bougie. Like I'll do a two step here and there. Yeah. yeah. No, I'm definitely not bougie when it comes to that. But I feel like people judge us as being bougie just because our parents and they might look at us and be like, oh those girls. Cause we're not super like we're friendly, but if we don't know you, we're not gonna be super duper. I smile talkative. Yeah, like we smile talkative people. people. Okay, Ava's the more talkative one. Zoe's yeah, the least people. talkative one, and I'm like in between. Between. If I don't know she, you, I really don't. the vibe first. Yeah, like I gotta feel your vibe out. If I like your vibe, then cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If I don't, I don't just automatically go talking to people because right. we don't know each other yet. So I have right. to know is this somebody I even want to talk to? You know. Right. So I definitely, I, and I don't think that's bougie. I think that's just watching who you're around and who you choose to have a conversation with. Now, of course, if somebody comes up to me and talks to me, always super sweet, always friendly. You know, mm-hmm. we're, we're super cool and we're super down to earth. Yeah. And that's like what I want people to know. Yeah. You know, it's another stereotype that I hate. Oh, you know, her friends are like this. So, you know, she like, like that. that. 
my friends are all so different but we have of course we have something in common of course but like when it comes to our individual personalities i am nothing like my friends so it's like I hate when people group me into being with this person. Oh, because she associated. She got to be like this. Yeah. No. That's not because how you get to know me. I agree in the same birds when we the flags together, but only partially. Because, of course, the girls you're friends with, you have stuff in common with. Obviously, y'all are friends. But sometimes, people's yeah. friends are like the polar opposites. Just because your friend did something don't mean you would do it. Do you it. know? Exactly. Like... You can't just say, oh, this girl, she her friend wild, her friend do this. She just like that. Mm. No, no, that's my friend. I love my friend, but that's my friend's decisions, mm -hmm. you know? It's just so, the real thing. It's just like, stop judging. Yeah. Like, yeah. If you or don't know this person, get yeah. to know. Find out. I feel like everybody has don't so judge. preconceptions and, oh, I, them girls like that or them girls like that. You don't know us. Yeah. So don't call us bougie, don't call us none of that. Like when you get to know us and we so cool, y'all gonna be like, what? Yeah. Totally, totally, right. totally. But yeah, I, I, I get the bougie thing. For sure. I've also got the oh, like she's mean thing. And that's so far from the truth. Super nice. I don't, I don't know. No, somebody doesn't call me mean before. I feel like people call you mean when you not off like that you're gonna just hurry up and talk with them and be super friendly but that's the thing i'm so far i will talk to strangers that's how friendly but i think a lot of times when people don't know you or you don't give them nothing to talk about they make they up come stuff up with stuff like about. oh she this she oh she's that way she's that way when really they don't know they don't know anything about you and that's the real team on that so are y'all gonna try these hand rolls? Yeah. Can I have the size one? Yeah. Y'all, this is high key my favorite. Octopus. We love it. I'm gonna grab a handy. <laughs> this one is a spicy tuna hand roll. Yummy. Yummy jams. Well, let's see, you actually have this if you want it. I want this one. Yay! Woo! This is my um, hand roll. This is a salmon avocado. Spicy tuna. Spicy tuna. Spicy tuna. Mm. These are so like fun to eat because you can hold it. Know you know what I do think we should do? Mm. Or try spicy, not spicy, but sushi burritos. Yes, we gotta try that. We do. For sure. I think that I've had a poke bowls. Bowls. sushi burritos. I love poke bowls. I don't like poke. I love I, I like don't know poke. why, but I do. She hates poke. I love poke. I like poke. <laughs> I like anything involving sushi. Mmm. -hmm. What y'all think? Good? Um, Good. This one really hit different. This sushi was like so good. It was so good. Shout out to Saki. Shout out to whoever sushi it up at Saki. Mm -hmm. Y'all did that. You're doing your thing. Keep it going. The cherry <laughs> blossom roll at Saki on the uptown um, location. Really good. Thank you later. You can eat really? it. Yeah. So, it's supposed to be good for you. I might eat one. 
But thank y'all so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Let us know what y'all favorite sushi is. Let yes. us know what stereotypes y'all get. Yeah, like what do people stereotype about y'all? Or like people's Both. common Both. like misconceptions yeah. about y'all. Yeah. All right, thank you.